Hi everyone, so today we have an, a quick analysis video of the Arizona Senate race between the incumbent Republican Doug Ducey and the Democratic challenger David Garcia. So first we'll look at some polling data that we've been getting. So the only poll that we have has by Gravis has David Garcia ahead by one. If I pull that open, it does show a narrow Garcia lead. However, this was done in a few months ago, all the way back in June, so probably not the most, the most, um, the best one. So, um, if we look at the Trump job approval, we have 11% and 11% um, somewhat approve and 35 strongly approve. So that gives us 46% approval rating compared to a 48% disapproval rating. So this might lean a bit more towards the Democratic side because if we look at when this poll was done back in June, um, it shows Arizona with a net zero approval rating, which, um, so this could show a slight lean towards the Democrats if Trump is underwater by two, but really, He's actually at zero. So the um, if we look at the last time Doug Ducey was on the ballot, it was in 2014, and he won by 11 points, which is very considerable. Um, so that's very good for Doug Ducey. Um, if we look at the... Um, I don't think I can find it now, but um, anyway... If we look at now the um, governor race, we have 389,000 votes on the Democratic side and 503,000 votes on the Republican side. Um, so that's very interesting to say the least. Um, so already all this result sort of favours the Republicans, and then if you look at the 2016 results, also favours the Republicans. If we were basing our argument just on this, you would probably put this as a lean Republican state. Um, but we also need to take into account Trump's approval rating, which is zero in the state of Arizona. He has a um, zero percent approval rating. Um, so that might move it more towards a tilt Republican direction. And um, that's where I'm going to leave it off, even though Doug Ducey's approval rating is underwater by two percent. I'm leaving it at that tilt Republican. Um, could even be lean Republican, but because of Doug Ducey, I'll put that as tilt Republican. So thank you guys for watching this video. Comment down suggestions below, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.